Pride and Prejudice, 10 out of 10. I truly believe that Pride and Prejudice is the most refreshing romance novel. I personally don't like reading romance that much, but I'm a more of a mystery kind of girl. But I honestly think that Jane Austen, in my eyes, is the best romance author. And so, I love Mr. Darcy. He's the love of my life because I see parts of me in his character. And I don't know what that means for me. Um, and I'm going to be very controversial, but I think... No, I know that I don't like Elizabeth Bennet. She's strong uh, as a woman and intelligent and, and beautiful and, you know, she has the package. But in reality, what gets to me is her arrogance. And I understand that that's the point of the book because it's called Pride and Prejudice. But it's not only with Mr. Darcy, it's with everybody. And she contradicts herself, herself a lot. And I don't like that. And I, until the end of the book, I was pissed at her, even though she finds she found her love of her life. Um, other than the, the other characters, which, you know, you have the Mr. Wickham, the Kitty, the whatever, all the characters have a point to be there, and, and they move the plot, um, they move the plot. The other characters are there, and they move the plot, and I love that. Um, it's not just that. I think the pace, the humor, and the overall love, and different kinds of love in the book uh, makes the book on point for me. Um, for me, Jane Austen doesn't put a word by accident. She knows where where to put the words, and she has made a great novel. Um, anyways, that was my opinion. Tell me yours, and also, what was your favorite romantic line in the book? Mine was, and I quote, I think you are in a very great danger of making him as much in love with you as ever. That was mine, so tell me yours. Bye!